Hey guys, it's Harriet or Wardy Seven Pool, whichever you prefer. So, as you can tell from the title, this is a video on how to speed up your Android phone or mm, Metro LG Esteem or whatever. It works for all Androids, okay? So, first thing, um, I'm going to tell you guys about is what I did or whatever to um, speed up my phone. So basically, um, I've had this phone for March, April, May, June, four months. I've had this phone and I have come across some issues. It froze on me a lot. And it wasn't doing that when I first got it, but it started freezing a lot. It started shutting off and doing all types of crap or whatever. So I was like, you know, it has to be something on my phone that, you know, that's doing that, you know, because it wasn't doing that when I first got it. So I decided to do some little things to it and it has been working like a charm since then. So... First thing I did, I took off Go Locker and Go Launcher EX because they were slowing my phone down. I noticed a lot of difference in the phone when I started using it. So I took that off and I have Widget Locker back on my phone even though this sometimes acts a little faulty but it's been working better because I can't stand the stock lock screen on this phone. I really don't like it. but yeah anyway so um first thing another thing i did i don't know if you guys remember from my how to customize your android video i had like seven wall uh, screens i had seven screens um i don't have seven screens anymore i only have two because i didn't use everything on there so I only have two screens now and that helped my phone a lot with um you know slowing down and freezing and stuff um another thing I did I went to my settings and then I went to display and animation and I turned off all of the animations no animations that slows your phone down a lot too I also have my brightness turned all the way down. That helps conserve battery. Um, another thing I did, I deleted a lot of these system apps that I don't use on my phone, but they run in the background. Like, um, I deleted, I'm gonna read them to you what I did. I deleted the analog clock bookmarks, the calendar widget, a uh, car home, desk home, digital clock, email, finance, Google. No, I didn't delete that one. Um, I deleted the world clock, live wallpapers, magic smoke wallpaper, memo widget. Um, I deleted a lot of things that I did not use, but they always turned on in my background. So I deleted a lot of those system apps and I also got this app called, where is it, Android System Cleaner and basically it's free in the Android market and basically what it does, it cleans everything in the phone that you don't use like the cache and um you know it clear it cleans the history like browser history clipboard missed calls incoming outgoing market history gmail history google earth google map history it cleans all of that so that helps your phone a lot too as you can see like let's show you right here see how my phone is going so fast with no delay look at that it's been working so much better since I did that another thing I suggest you want to do 
if you notice your phone is acting a little faulty clean the internal memory on your computer hook your phone up to the computer and put it in mass storage and cleanse take everything off your internal memory and then run run a system scan from your computer on your internal memory on the phone that will help a great deal because I found out I had four viruses on my internal memory so that helps a lot if you do that um, if you want I will show you guys show you guys a video on how to do that like a tutorial on that I think I may just do it anyway um, so you guys could do that because when I did it I found four viruses on my internal memory and I think that may have had something to do with why my phone was acting a little faulty so that works a lot and I also clean my memory card and I think I had two viruses on my memory card so I clean that off and my phone has been working like a charm since then so it really does work for you to like instead of getting rid of your phone you have to really get down deep into it to figure out what's wrong with it especially if it was working just fine and then all of a sudden it's not working anymore so yeah and also the case I have is a Trident Perseus case and I got it from eBay for $12 yeah it was $12 on eBay and it's just a regular silicone case you know it's easy to install it doesn't come off when you drop your phone or anything like that um, it's really good it's not heavy or anything so yeah and I mean look at this my phone is running so much better like so much better I'm so proud of myself but <laughs> yeah and that's pretty much it you guys if you have any questions or anything like that you can leave it in the comments or you can hit me up on Instagram yes I have an Instagram and my Instagram is at I R O K K S M I I L E Z at I Rock Smiles. That is my name on there. Or you can search for Womack, which is W H O O O A underscore M A C K. But it's probably not going to be under that. But just search for I at I rock smiles and I do follow back so yeah so um other than that that's it and I will talk to you guys later bye